I understand in addition to the mRNA study that we just discussed, there are a number of new clinical trials underway, including one that my sister was recently accepted into. And I wanted to ask, what do you see as the promise for the ones that are specifically going after biomarkers like KRAS? Personalized medicine, I think, is really exciting and important for pancreatic cancer. I can tell you, PanCan, 10 years ago, it was not clear or understood if personalized medicine was useful for pancreatic cancer patients. And so PanCan started a program called Know Your Tumor, where we offered the opportunity for people who called our patient services program to get both genetic and biomarker testing. And biomarker testing means that you're getting information back that will tell you if you have any specific mutations in your tumor that would then tell you the kind of targeted treatment that you should use on that mutation. And so one of the mutations, you mentioned KRAS. So KRAS is mutated in 90 to 95% of patients with adenocarcinoma pancreatic cancer. If we could figure out how to target KRAS, there is definitely belief that will be significant in providing a, an essential treatment option for patients. However, historically, RAS, the RAS family, which KRAS is a part of, has been very difficult to target and treat in patients. It has only been recently, in the last really couple of years, where there started to be some progress, in particular in lung cancer, in targeting RAS. And so those learnings are now being applied in pancreatic cancer. I would say the development of those studies is still in early stages, but there is certainly a tremendous amount of hope that we can figure out how to target KRAS, as well as, quite frankly, other mutations that patients have, pancreatic cancer patients have, that will significantly help to change outcomes for patients.